Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to check your 12 volt battery health and how to get into service mode because that's how you can check it. So that tutorial is coming up. So what we're going to do to check the battery health of your 12 volt battery is we're going to go into service mode. So I know the service mode is kind of a thing that I don't think very many people know how to do, but it's very useful for a lot of different things. So the way we get into service mode is if you go down to the car button here, go to software, and then what you want to do is you want to hold for mine model Y, just anywhere on the model Y for like three seconds and it'll come up with a little blink thing and then we'll show you what to do next. So hopefully you can see this. So you see that blink, then you let go and it says enter an access code and all you have to put in is service. Super simple and then just hit okay. And it says you want to enter service mode, you say enable and now you're in service mode. So there's a whole bunch of things you can check here. I'm not gonna go over all of them, I'm just going to go over how to do the 12 volt since you know we know that Tesla's uh, Achilles, Achilles heel is the 12 volt and it actually just happened on our Model 3 over here on the on the left, um, it basically, my wife was driving one day and just died. That was it, no notification, even though it was supposed to come up and just battery's dead. So the way you check it is this, this screen will come up and you wanna go into battery and then go to low voltage and it'll actually tell you your high voltage battery and your low voltage battery. So obviously the low voltage is the 12 volt and it's green, which is good. And it says SOC of the battery right now is 79%. And we're just looking at current voltage minus 0 0.4, 0 0.24 amps and then 15 volts. So it looks like my, uh, you know, 12 volt battery is fine. High voltage battery, the big battery is fine too. And so that's how you check it. And so another note too, I'm not sure if this is like checking the, the battery is only for the lithium ion 12 volts that they're now putting in the Model 3s and Model Ys because our uh, model 3 over here on the left is a 2018 it has a lead acid battery and i tried doing the same thing and there is no like battery uh line to to hit so on that car i can't check the 12 volt which is kind of weird we're on the same software which is uh 2022 28.28.2 28 so i know it's not that but for whatever reason, only on this car, I can check the battery. So I'm guessing it's because of the lithium ion battery in this car. So that's a heads up for you guys too. Um, so that's basically how you do the 12 volt. I just want to go over a couple other things in the service mode. So one other thing I think is pretty important for service mode is the software uh, reinstall. So you can see all these little options down here and stuff. And so if for whatever reason, I know this happens a lot, like you're trying to install an update and it gets stuck or something and you can't get it. Uh, this is a way to avoid having to go talk to Tesla for them to basically, you know, get rid of the update that you're in and then send it to you again. All you need to do is get into service mode here and then just go to software reinstall, hit that, and then you can reinstall the software and then you don't have to bother with talking, talking to them and dealing with them at all. You just do it yourself. So that's the two things I want to show you. There's some other you know, things in here that you can look at if you want. Driver assist, it shows you the cameras and the sensors, sensors makes, it tells you if those are, you know, all good and everything. And then there's also some thermal action stuff. I didn't really look in this that closely, but some other things you can do here and then some other, you know, service mode stuff that you probably shouldn't really be touching because this is really for the, you know, the service center to use. But if you want to go mess around and go in here, you can too. And so, Hopefully that was helpful. Uh, the way to get out of service mode, which is important too, is on this main screen here, you just hit exit service mode. And then it goes right back to, you know, the car like nothing happened and you can drive around as normal. So that's how you do that. That's how you check the 12 volt in your service mode and how to get in and out of service mode. So hope that tutorial is helpful and thanks for watching.